Okay, guys. Okay, guys. I am... First, I'm testing this equipment right now. Um, <clears throat> let me show you what's on my plate for you guys. Let me show you what's going on. I don't know. Okay, this entire folder right here. You see all these scriptures right here? Y'all see all the, all the scriptures? You see all these images and just everything's been organized and outlined. You see all these links? So starting up here with the deceit of women, this, um, this link. That begins, that begins the accumulation of data that I need to present to you guys that I haven't been able to present. And the reason is, as one thing comes in and I fill up an entire folder of information, as I'm, when I say an entire folder, when I start filling up that folder, I get ready to do a video after an entire day of processing this information, praying having the Lord reveal it, show it to me. It's so, it's so mentally overloading. It's so, it's so conclusive. It's what I already know. However, it's a way of handing it off again in a way that's so definitive. It's like, I guys, I don't even know how to describe it to you. It's, 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 it's too definitive to to warn any opposition argument from any way shape or form because it's biblical do you understand the whole thing is biblical so when the lord gives you something for example let's say isaiah 29 those who try and hide their plans they turn everything upside down so when the lord gives you a scripture and he gives you the use and the application of that scripture uh, for example, if I take, you know, obviously the image of a sheep or whatever it is, and I turn it upside down, uh, and it's an image of the virgin, then I've used the application of that scripture. Here's a good example right here, lurking class. Well, so let me, I need to explain this to you so you guys understand. So lurking class, this image right here, um, it has... The image for lurking class right here, which is the Grim Reaper, and you turn it upside down, it's a bug hatching. And right here is uh, the, the scripture that goes with it. And see, just like right now, I'm gonna, I, I'm discovering right now that this thing has been put in here, but it wasn't checked. So you see the writing in here? The scripture in, the, in this photo right here, it, describe, it describes what's going on with these two other images. So what it does is it, it takes the imagery, the spiritual gift the Lord gave me, it takes that straight to the Bible. Like, why is there a clothing line called Lurking Class? Don't you think that's kind of a weird name for a clothing company? And this is just one small example. I, I have that entire folder to share with you. And, um, and it's every day that I've sat down to do the video for you guys, and I do mean every single day I've sat down right here to go, okay, I've got to deliver this. What happens is it just gets bigger and bigger and bigger. So as I'm sitting here contemplating what to do, how to do this, let me ask you guys. Would you guys prefer that I just take this folder and I do a marathon today? Because I'll do it. I, I, As a matter of fact, I kind of want to just get it off my shoulders. Or <clears throat> do you want me to do it in small separate videos where... I take one of the concepts and I just go boom and I set it there as a small. Um, I don't know what's going to work best uh, for my ability to deliver it, but here's what I can tell you. Sometimes once I get going and I get into all this information and I start shoving it out, um, just to cut it off and to restart it again is, is kind of a, it's a little acrimonious. It's not the easiest thing in the world. So... <clears throat> I got up this morning and I said, there's no way I'm going to wait to even later in the day to do this. I'm just going to drink some coffee and I'm going to sit down and I'm going to just knock this thing out of the park. I've got to. 
Y'all have to see this. This is the understanding of the end of the world. Well, don't you want to know why the world is being completely destroyed by fire? I do. I mean, it's the same as the days of Noah, but I'm going to prove it to you. I'm going to show you why the reason in, in the scriptures, what the Lord says. And then I'm going to let you see the scriptures and look at the spiritual gift that the Lord gave me. And we're just going to tie the two together with the picture, right with the scripture. I mean, I already made, I already made the images. I had Dave make them, but I'm going to have to have some of them remade obviously right now, because I can't read the, the image uh, that has the scripture on it. So I'm going to call Dave right now. I'm going to open up that whole darn folder and every scripture that's not legible. I'm going to have him redo it so we can, having in a higher uh, DPI or something so it's more le so it's completely legible. Y'all should go over my folders now. This is the time for everyone to do what I've done. Um, it's one thing to watch the videos, guys. It's one thing to sit here and watch the videos that the Lord has me produce. But when you go through this data yourself, you handle every picture, you click on every single picture. Remember, I've handled these pictures dozens of times each image and so it sunk into a level that's beyond uh, anyone's comprehension that hasn't done what I've done because the Lord used me as a point man to get this information out. So when you handle this information all the time and you handle the scriptures all the time that become that are part of this information just like lurking class and where is lurking class in the scriptures? It's in the scriptures. Everything I'm showing you is in the Word of God. That's what makes it so powerful. And so once you handle this stuff like lurking class and you handle Ezekiel, I'm against you women who hunt the souls of men to make your pillows fly. And you tie the two together with the vocabulary in the Bible and the Lord confirms, yes, this is what it is. That's why there's a clothing line called lurking class. It's Elohim mocking you using the biblical passage under, the understanding of that biblical passage is the very thing that is mocking you and making fun of those that are getting murdered because this is a big murder fest is what the earth is. It's Burning Man Fest. You know, the Burning Man Festival out in the desert. That's what the whole earth is. Burning Man. The whole earth is a Burning Man Festival. And the, uh, like Marina Abramovic, spirit cooking. One spirit cooking the other. That's what the whole earth is. I can prove it all day long now. I own the information. The information dwells inside of me completely with the word of God. And I can lay it out now in a way that I haven't been able to just pump out. I don't think, not like this, not like, not, not like now. So I want to go over this thing. You can leave your opinion of what you think you'd like to see on the vids, but I probably have three to four hours of video to crank out and to show you guys, to give you the, this complete understanding of what the Lord's given me. I just want to give to you what he, what he gives to me because what he gives to me is so precious. It's so mind boggling. It's so valuable. It's like giving you a billion dollars every time he gives me what he gives me. Um, there's no greater joy that I get than giving you what he's given me. That's where I get my joy. It's like, thank you. I get to give this away to people. I get to be the person that gives this to others. That's all I want. That's the only thing I want is to see you set free, see your mindset set free and know, so that you know your soul is safe. Knowing your soul is safe is the greatest, most valuable thing there is. There's nothing more valuable then knowing that you know that you know your soul is safe and you're at peace, total peace, okay? That's my goal. And then you can work on spreading the news to others and I'm going to talk about there's a way to do it and there's a way not to do it. And um, I'm going to try and help some people with that because I know like a lot of people struggle and I understand because I had a learning curve at the beginning of getting saved on how, to, how do I show this to people? What do I do? And so I'm going to try and help you with that as well. Okay, this is a little check-in. I'm going to get some coffee. I'm going to wash my face. I literally just woke up, and I'm just going to wash my face. I'm going to get some coffee, take a minute, fix what's wrong with this folder that I've run across, uh, and then uh, I'm going to get to it. So today, this video is coming at you. Uh, leave your comment if you, you know, here, here's another thought. For the people that are like, oh, the videos are too long, here's my suggestion. Pause it.
write down where you pause it at the one hour, 20 minute mark, and then come back and start it again. Okay. That's just, I see people, oh, why do you make videos are so long? It's like, you're welcome. <laughs> it's like, it's just more video. All you got to do is pause it uh -huh, and come back to it because I don't, I don't keep going on a video and make it longer unless I'm just led to keep going and keep doing it. Do you understand? So anyway, um, I know I said I was going to do these short little 20 minute series, but because I have been receiving more data than I know what to do with, I don't even know what to do with all this data, but it's so profound. It, every bit of it, every scintilla of it is so profound that I just sit here and am, I am stunned, stunned at the understanding and the knowledge that the Lord's given me and the ability to understand, process, receive, and tie it all to the Bible. It's stunning. It's beyond the human brain. And literally, I just sit here and go, this is... Anyway, so I'll quit pontificating that. Let's just get to it. Let's get, get on to it. So uh, I got to call Dave the way and we got to fix some stuff. Okay. See you today. Bye.